Hello everyone, your tech enthusiast here and today I will show you how to make your Windows 11 desktop look clean and minimal. So let's get straight to it. So if we open up right now to the settings right here and go to the system and go uh, about the device, I will currently show you that we are actually currently running on the latest uh, version of Windows um, 11 which is 22132. So let's go straight to your web browser and we will download the program called Win, uh, Taskbar X. So Taskbar X and we will go to his uh, Chris's, Chris's GitHub and go here to the releases, click here to the plus 48 releases and I will download Taskbar X version 1.7.1.0 x 64 bit so this stands for 64 bit zip download so i will click that and save the file and i will go here to the as you can see downloads and just extract the folder and you will get this folder to from the taskbar x so for the, this to work we will now um, open up this folder that we just extracted and here we have taskbar x configurator and you should probably also run a taskbar x first so uh, when the taskbar x is running i will show you just that in a minute so if we go to the task manager and go to the, the taskbar x as you can see it's currently running and it's using about uh, 9.4 megabytes of system memory so uh, open up right now taskbar x configurator and now, we'll, now we will change some settings right here for our uh, taskbar. So style, we will change the style. This program uh, allows us to change a lot of things right here. So transparency, transparent gradient, opaque, blur and acrylic. But I will need to have the proper um, wallpaper for this to work because uh, then I can adjust these settings based on uh, our wallpaper. So right now I will download the wallpaper from the thumbnail. So wallpaper, wallpapers home. This is the web web page where I get most of my wallpapers, uh, and I think it's quite nice. So if we go to the nature and click this one on the green, there are some ads right there. If we go to the green section and go to the second page I think and here we have this grass the grass green in 5k so I will download this one and save it as um, uh, image file so right now I will set this uh, image to um, our wallpaper so here set it as desktop background and as you can see wallpaper changed right now I think that uh, Windows has some bugs right now so I will need to apply um, the wallpaper again and as you can see it's currently showing just find our wallpaper right now I will pick um, blur as my personal preference for the our taskbar it looks nice right now and of course I will put red green and blue to the maximum values but you can also change it by your personal preference and I will also add some alpha to for example to 35 35 as you can see it looks uh, a bit transparent and it looks quite nice so we are done here but as as I said before you can change a lot of things right here by uh, um, just by personal opinions and uh, preferences a lot of things so animations position startup extra and mechanics and I think this is uh, really good with this program so right now we will actually have another program which is called uh, rounded taskbar so search for that on Google <laughs> so this is a rounded tab and we will go to the github again and we will download the latest version uh, on the uh, their um, github but this one is currently in the demo preview release which also adds support for uh, as you can see support for uh, Windows 11 so I will download this one so I will download the demo zip which is the uh, version 3.0 so click OK save the file go back to the downloads folder and as you can see we have all these uh, files and we will extract the, the rounded db uh, that we just downloaded so I will just wait a second so that is complete 
And as you can see, the rounded uh, taskbar is currently um, uh, extracted and I will launch the application itself. In advance, we go to the advanced settings and I will uh, enable the dynamic mode. So I will click apply. And as you can see, the clock and calendar and all these widgets on the right uh, have currently disappeared. And as you can see, it works just fine. We can also um, show system tray and adjust some settings. As you can see, we uh, can enable these settings to show system tray and it works just fine. But in my opinion, it looks quite ugly. So I will apply these settings right here. So uh, as you can see, this is also very early stage of this build of uh, rounded taskbar, it, but it will have some glitches and it don't it doesn't work with uh, a taskbar auto height. So uh, I hope you do guys don't use this feature. So as you can see, it looks quite nice. Looks like a bit like Mac OS, uh, and uh, yeah. This is it for this video. Thank you all for watching this one in particular. Maybe consider subscribing to the channel and also like this video and comment down below what do you think about this rounded taskbar uh, customization. So with that being said, thank you all for watching and I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.